Alright, what's up guys? So in today's video, I'm gonna be turning these turn signals into full custom LED turn signals. So yeah, I'm um, really excited to how it's gonna turn out. Um, I recently did my tail light swap for my 240SX and it came out amazing. So I'm going to be applying a lot of safety logic and hopefully I can turn this into something really cool. But yeah, with that being said, uh, let's get right in. Alright, I'm back with the voiceover and th in this video I'm going to be skipping a lot of process because I kind of did the same thing as I did for the tail light. So if you guys need to refer back to it as a reference, please do so prior to watching this video because I'm going to be skipping like I said. And right now I'm cutting out the uh, turn signal and opening it up, taking off the reflectors or lens or whatever that I needed to take out. And yeah, then now you're going to make a mold with the cardboard and shaping the way you want the circuit to be. Um, I made it a little bit bigger just in case because, you know, like I said, if it doesn't work out and stuff, like I can always cut it a little bit smaller and make it work. So yeah, always cut it bigger than you're supposed to. And what I'm doing now, I'm getting the center of the circle. So, you know, that's where you're going to adjust it. Um, yeah. And now this is how it looks when you cut out the circuit. Um, it's not fully circle, I know. But anyway, when you do that and then put the um, vinyl wrap over it and this is how it looks and you poke a hole, you know how I talk about it on my other video. So this is how you do it and it's a heart shape. And now we're going to put the LEDs on. All right, so now we're moving on to the circuit uh, plan. So basically, it's the same LED as I use for the tail light. It's called Flux LEDs. Um, I have the link in the description of where you can buy them. But I really, really recommend you guys to watch my three parts tail light video you know, before you're doing this because I explain a lot of important parts and if you wanted to, you know, like make sense of what I'm doing, um, I suggest you guys sh should go ahead and watch that. Anyway, so basically this is my mapping of the way I'm gonna put my LEDs. Before it was four LEDs of one group, but now I change it to five LEDs of one group. So there's gonna be two groups of five LEDs and I found out that I need 220 ohm resistance to the each group. And so I figured I can use my 120 ohm uh, resistors. So I'm gonna be using two of each on the both side. So that's gonna be the plan. All right, so I just connected all together, soldered and ready to go. And this is how it looks. So yeah, as you can see, it's a heart shape. And yeah, you kind of want to just like play around and see how you want your placement to be. So it took me a while to figure that out, but it was fairly really, really easy process. All right, now it's time to test to see if it works or not. So because there are five LEDs of 2.0 volts, um, I set it at 10 volts and here's how it looks. It works. All right, now, so I put the LEDs inside the housing and here's how it looks. So I put it all the way in the front against the reflector because so that way I can see the heart uh, very prominently. So yeah, same thing as my tail light. When you hook it, everything up, put the voltage at 4.1 volt and then test it to see if it works. Uh, make sure that everything works before you close it in. Um, and the way I wired it, uh, same thing as the way I did for my tail light. Um, if you watch my tail light video, you will definitely understand how to do it. And yeah, here's how it looks. Um, right now it's hyper flashing because I don't have the relay to fix the hyper flashing. 
but you can kind of see like the heart but it's not really there does that make sense because i was like going for that look so yeah it looks super nice i'm super satisfied with the way it came out and it's nice that i finished it in four hours so that was really nice well this is it for today's video uh, thank you guys so much for watching i had a lot of fun doing this and you know i hope you guys if you guys have any questions just let me know in the comment section i will be happy to help you guys out but yeah um thank you guys so much for watching and follow all my social media if you guys like this video please give it a thumbs up and i hope to see you guys on the next video peace out